Welcome back to another video, Soil here, and today I want to talk about moving average ribbon and how you can use it for evaluating strength or weakness of a trend and discovering potential changes in the direction of the market. Stay tuned and let's get started. Moving average ribbon is simply having several moving averages with different length or look back period and different colors all together on the chart. And this group of moving average lines create a ribbon like appearance. You can add them manually one by one and in the setting give them your desired length and color and you can choose simple moving average exponential moving average or any other types of moving average you prefer but in most of trading platforms you can use a ready to use indicator for this purpose for example on trading view in the indicators simply search ribbon and you can see that we have a built-in indicator which has been recently added by TradingView and also many community scripts written by other traders. The one that is from TradingView has uh, only four moving average lines and here in the settings we have more details to adjust. You can remove them by unselecting them or you can select the type of moving averages you desire. The default settings for the length of moving average lines are 20, 50, 100, and 200, which are the most popular and common ones among traders of different types. And you can change the style of the lines here in this tab. The moving average ribbons that are written by other traders, some of them have uh, more numbers of lines and options uh, like this one which has uh, eight moving average lines and their length by default is ranging from 20 to 55 kind of suitable for short term to midterm analysis of the market and of course you can change the length of them based on your trading style and preferences we continue with this default setting and let's see how we analyze the moving average ribbon moving average ribbon is a collection of moving averages and these moving average lines can be be analyzed separately and the interpretation is similar to the ones using one two or three moving averages like using a moving average for identifying the direction of the market and price crossovers or two moving averages for double crossovers of the short-term moving average over the long-term moving average triple crossovers and so on if you are not familiar with different types of moving averages and how they are analyzed and used for trading i have a comprehensive tutorial about about moving average the link also in the description of this video and I recommend you to watch it later because moving averages play a role in many trading strategies and they are a base for many famous indicators all right getting back to moving average ribbon with the ribbon as a collection of moving averages we can discover relationships for multiple moving averages at once if all moving averages in the ribbon are moving in the same direction like here on the chart as you can see or here in this part it shows that we are in a strong trend because all the moving averages from short to long all of them agree on the current direction of the market which shows strength in the trend but when their direction is different like here in this part as you can see it shows that this uh, range of short to long moving averages don't agree on the same direction and the trend is uh, possibly weakening if the move of these collection of uh, moving average lines are in the same direction and upward it shows that the prices are advancing likely in an uptrend and when the move is downward it shows that the prices are declining you must also uh, pay attention to the distance between moving average lines in the ribbon if they're all moving with the same distance over time it shows that the trend is strong if the ribbon is expanding and the moving averages are getting farther from each other like here as you can see or here in this part it could possibly show that the current trend is weakening and there is a possibility for ending of the trend and if the ribbon is contracting and the moving average lines are getting closer to each other and even crossing like here as you can see it shows the possibility for a new trend to emerge or it can also show consolidation and then higher pressure in the direction of the existing trend
trend. For example, here you can see that in the direction of this downtrend, uh, here we got contraction in the ribbon and then declining of the price according to the prior direction of the market. And uh, also crossing of the lines can give us signals on the changes in the direction of the market. When the shorter lines are crossing above the longer lines, it shows that a new uptrend is uh, possibly starting. And if the shorter lines are crossing below the longer lines, it indicates that uh, possibly a downtrend is starting. You can also follow the price and see how it uh, crosses different moving averages in the ribbon. By the help of moving average ribbon, you can discover what is happening in both short term and long term and identify trend and crossovers by looking at a variety of moving averages of different length. And also you can evaluate the strength or weakness of a trend and any changes in momentum by looking at the distances between the lines, their expansion and contraction. Please pay attention that like any other tools in technical analysis, you should never take your trading decisions only based on moving average ribbon and you must use it in conjunction with other tools and concepts of technical analysis. All right, that's it. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, feel free to ask and leave a comment for me. I'll answer your questions as soon as possible. If you found any value in this video, please like it. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit the bell so you get the notifications of my new videos. See you guys in next video and good luck with your trading.